hope that you are blessed and well. If you are new here, welcome to the channel. Thank you so much for clicking on the video. There will definitely be something here for you either in this video or in any of my other videos. So feel free to check out the library. If you are returning, hey, so family, what's going on? I hope you guys are well. I hope that you are loving on yourself and having a wonderful day. Let's go ahead and take a few deep breaths. Inhale positive life force energy and exhale any stress or anxiety you're feeling at this time. Most high God, divine Holy Spirit, angels, ancestors, spirit guides, guardian angels, divine beings of the highest white light, archangel spirit guides, divine ancestors, please come in and connect with me now. Please allow me to channel the current energies for the collective to reveal what we need to know. Let there be no me and only you. Most high God, please anoint and authorize every word that comes out of my mouth. Archangel Michael, please come in and connect with me. Please clear the energy in the space. Please protect our energy, myself and the collective. And please encamp the angels of protection and war around us at this time. Anything that's coming towards us that is not of the highest white light, we ask that you banish it and transmute any dark energy into positivity. Ashe. Thank you. All right, so as I was cleaning up, as always, this card fell out and the guides let me know that there is something significant about energy transference that needs to be addressed, that needs to come out. So they also guided me to this book. So there's something here. Most High God, what is the message? Divine Holy Spirit, what is the message? Watch carefully. Watch your thoughts. They become words. Watch your words. They become actions. Watch your actions. They become habits. Watch your habits. They become character. Watch your character, for it becomes your destiny. Okay? watch carefully this is about energy transference this is about how energy works if you are having dark or negative thoughts they can become what you speak out when it becomes what you speak out it incites action when it incites actions it becomes habitual okay so there's something internal with this energy transference you could be picking up on something from the outside i do feel an outside energy connecting with you that may be projecting thoughts onto you but for some of you it's internal so let's get some energy and see what's going on <clears throat> okay we have obstacles and challenges in the upright transformation in the reverse this is somebody that's projecting difficulty on you and not wanting you to transform not wanting you to heal okay so they could be projecting and then you could be sitting in those thoughts and uh just like the book said okay so we're gonna see what's going on here magician spell work projections okay so that's for some so be sure that you're cleansing your energy protecting your energy seven of wands energy okay so that you're blocking this type these types of energies out we got heartache and loss here what else holy spirit material harvest new beginnings in the reverse is this in the reverse too yes okay so this is what is here 
heartache and loss in the upright, material harvest in the reverse, new beginnings in the reverse, heavy projections of these unfavorable outcomes. Somebody's trying to transfer this energy over to you. Okay. So, and some, for some, there's somebody here that's just sitting in that energy and there are no outside projections. But for the most part, I feel like this definitely projections for most of you. Okay, anything else? One more. Transformation in the reverse. Okay, so this is all, this, all this is negative energy. Okay, we bind and block this energy. Mm, yeah, mm -mm. Base chakra. Okay, so someone could be trying to attack your sacral chakra so that you're not grounded. You don't feel stable. You don't feel secure. You are not able to manifest wealth. You are not, um, yeah, obstacles and challenges energy. Okay, um, somebody's trying to look at this aid in the reverse somebody's trying to project onto you that you that the divine is not connected you're not working with the divine somebody's doing the most okay so you got to quickly cleanse your energy and snap out of this yeah loss somebody's sending you a wee okay What's heartache and loss? Why is this here? Somebody that's operating out of ego that wants to change your fate. They see you as this caring person or someone that is cared for and they want to destroy you. They want to wear the crown, is what I'm hearing. They want to be the chosen one, the divine one that has the blessings, the material harvest, the new beginning and transformation that you truly do have. This person wants to feel at ease like they feel you are, okay? What's material harvest in the reverse? <laughs> yeah, this person will be at ease when you have no money. This, this makes this person feel <sighs> when your material harvest is out of whack, okay? No money, no finances, no uh, nothing. You're not gaining anything. Your loss is their gain. Wow. What else for material harvest in the reverse? Okay. This person memory in the reverse you don't have any fond memories of this person this person hates to, to look back on whatever experiences that the two of you have had it's like this person has been obsessed with your gifts the gifts that you receive, your spiritual gifts, your other gifts, your receiving gift. This person has just, this, this person hates it. This person hates the self-love or the people that love you. It's stressed this person out and they've gone mad, okay? 